Enter the side-splitting universe of Karens and Kevins, where humor knows no bounds. Brace yourself for an entertaining expedition filled with laughter. Jumping right in, this Karen believes she owns the lane and gets upset when someone changes into it. Angry redhead Karen upset after I got into her lane sound on. Customers to back the game and was expected to get one eventually. And they've been given a different game that nobody wanted. And the other ones that can want to change the MMO that they've been waiting for. Why are you mad? Kill somebody today for no reason. I used my blinker. I, I, I had plenty of room. No, you did not, mother. <laughs> oh, what a. Oh, that's great. Oh, my God, that's great. Now, this next Karen freakout is just too good not to show. Roll the clip. <laughs> I got the deals on the phone. Come see me in the back. I got the deals on the phone. I got an iPhone 14, $43. iPhones, Galaxy. You guys work with Walmart? I used to be in the back. Yeah? And you do your when you with me. I do look like that. You call non-existent. Yeah, I do. You look wrong with me. I'm not going to say. Where the f*** out of school today? I don't know where do I work. You guys do have a new machine trespassing. I'll tell you Having a crazy landlord like this, yeah, probably extremely difficult. Roll the clip. And he's changing the locks right now, by the way. He's doing that right now, so if you were to leave out today, I don't know. Mm. Not to be done, and you know what? You haul storage on Mass Ave. That's where it'll be, and I'll pay for it. You're not gonna touch my stuff. Oh, I already got people coming. I already got people coming. Believe it, because you can't lock that, huh? Well, I'm gonna go to work later, Believe so. It. Well, good, good, good. 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 Just don't touch my stuff. Good. I promise you, on Jesus Christ, your will be out of here tomorrow. And you're playing with the island. I'm letting you know that right now. Like I said, all that will be gone. Locks changed. And I'll say I never knew you. And the thing on the thing is not even mine. <laughs> it's not even mine. It's fake. <laughs> what are you talking about? What's fake? <laughs> eh, eh, I got you. Hey, What's fake? It's raw. It ain't even mine. Mm. What's fake? Mm. Mm, mm, mm. I know what I be doing. That's wrong. What's fake? <laughs> it ain't even mine. <laughs> your signature? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I know what I be doing, yo. I know the game. It's not even mine. Look at it. Go look at it. Go look at it. <laughs> Cause it's your lights here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not gonna even let it out, but it's not even mine. It ain't even mine. It ain't even mine. Ain't no mail came here. You got to prove it. 
You got to prove it. You got to prove it, but you can't. Okay? So therefore, bye-bye. Bye-bye. And so now, this time tomorrow, you'll be gone, and I'll be at peace. You done? You wouldn't be popping all this. I gotta go. You done? You wouldn't be popping all this. Walk out that door. I bet you when he's done, you won't be able to get back in. You won't have to ring that doorbell. And you know what? I plead the fifth. I don't know who that is. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> I know how to do it. Believe that. Uh, you know. You so know. can you just confirm, since you're a tough guy, can you just confirm that's wrong? Yours? That's wrong. What was fake? That's wrong. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Well, so now you shut up because the camera's going. I don't know what you're talking about. You're saying what's fake. I don't know what you're talking about. You're an idiot. Yeah, that's fake. Go look at it. Go look at it. Go look at it. Go look at it. It's wrong. So, you have no grounds, buddy boy. You're weird. Yeah, you got issues. Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead. <laughs> yeah. No, not weird. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Be careful. You idiot. <laughs> uh, so you get it now? Uh, uh, you got played. Uh, you got played. <laughs> That's why he left, because he knew he got played. You got played too. You are a disgrace. And right now when you close the door, your silent thoughts, you're so sad inside. You are. You're sad inside. You really are. I feel bad for you. I know when you close the door, you'll probably cry. You'll probably go back into your little and get sad again. Yeah, yeah, you will. You will. Have your fun now. But when that door closed, we know what psychological problems go on. We know you go into your deep thoughts. We know you do that. We know, I know that. I've been in the medical field long enough to know. When that door closed, you're a very sad soul, a very lonely soul. I know that. I can see it. I can tell by looking in your eyes. You're dead inside your eyes. There's no life. There's no happiness. There's no nothing. You don't even have a girlfriend. If you did, you'd go live with her. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. You really should. You got your little job now. No, you don't. You're not working. You're not working. You're a liar. I don't believe nothing you say. Everything you say is a lie. But I tell you what, the locks will be changed tomorrow. Oh, but it does not stop there. Because there is more. Check it out. Did you turn the heat on? I'm asking you a question. Hello? Don't turn it on the again. What? Did you turn this heat on? I can't hear you. What did you say? Did you turn the heat on? Is there a problem? No. Did you turn the heat on? I'm asking if there's a problem. Yeah, there's a problem. The heat's on. Okay. Did you turn I'm asking you. Did you turn it on? I'm a little cold. Well, you know what? I have nothing to do with that. Don't touch my heat. No, it's my heat. I live here. Look, goddamn it! You don't like to open this door. Don't touch my heat. Why are you banging on my door? Like I said. Yup. Then stop touching my. I ain't got nothing to do with your my door. Or what? You ain't no bills here. What's gonna happen if I do? Like I said. You threatening me? See, I was gonna let the little stay a little longer. You know what? You, you know what? Let me call John right now. You don't turn my. On, and nobody in your home. Someone's always going there doing something. You did. Call John. You stole my gift card. Like, why the would I do some petty like that? Because you're you a petty. I'm getting a block chain right now. I'm not going for this. You don't pay no bills. I paid all the bills. You paid all the bills? Yeah, I. Right. See, so you know what it is? I'm going to show you something. I'm going to show you something right now. You threatening me? I'm showing sure, uh, yeah, show you I'm showing you something right now. Oh, so you're threatening me. I'm showing you something right now. So you know what you think you're gonna try to do? You're gonna try to stay here, but I'm gonna promise you something on my life. You leaving out of here tomorrow. We'll see. I don't appreciate that word. You don't call me that slur, please. You heard what I said. Please don't call me that word again. Twin. Don't let my back my case. I'm also to the station. I'm getting a restraining order. I'm saying I'm fear of my life. Good luck. You don't know how much power I got. Yep. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. I look down on people like you. You see the bottom of my shoe? That's where you belong. And I step on people like you, you maggot. Thank and you. your whole family are all rats. Thank you. Because look at the little product that I don't fall to fuck you up from trees. Thank you. <laughs> Please. Thank you. You don't need help. You. I beg you. <laughs> <laughs> you need to be stopped.
stop. Static. Just stop. You need to be in the static. Just stop. You know what? If you were my kid, you wouldn't do. You shit. would be the abortion that lived. Oh. I would have aborted you. Cause you know what? You're crazy. I'm glad you when the constable get here, you are not gonna say that. Yeah, and you're probably friends with him too. I am. I fuck him. So what if I did? He's a constable. He ain't gonna break the rules for me. That's one thing they're not gonna lose their job over me. Who Three months you? probation? Yeah. There's no yeah. such thing. It's yeah. It's what I do, it's my, it's my rules and I wouldn't let it. Angry father, or we could say turkey, chases a suspicious slow-moving white van out of his neighborhood. Okay, seriously, this turkey has been stalking the mail truck throughout the entire neighborhood. <laughs> oh my God. This is so funny. <sighs> okay, and there he goes. <laughs> There it goes. <laughs> oh my god, this is so great. Moving forward, this guy gets roasted for texting bad things about the person next to him. Is he wrong? Hi, nice to meet you. Um, I couldn't help but notice that before we took off, you were sending really horrible text messages about me to somebody. I wasn't. I have photos. Yes, you were. You said uh, they said something about, well, hope she didn't have any Mexican food, and you said, oh, she ate a Mexican. Well, if my flight doesn't take off the ground, you know why, and stuff like that. I I saw the whole thing. I apologize. I was drinking. I apologize. Yeah, just, you have no idea who you'll hurt with those kind of things. I have more drinks. You got me, and I was drinking, and I have more drinks. So you were drinking, okay. And, like, do you normally make fun of fat people? Like, is that yeah. something that you like you, to do? You notice, that, you notice that I was nice to you when we were in the air, and I put the thing up for you. Right. Part of my table. Right, I didn't want part of your table. You made me feel so uncomfortable to exist in this seat that I didn't want anything from you. I didn't well, want you to pick up my thing off the floor. You know, you know, in fairness, in fairness, you probably shouldn't be sitting in the edge of those seats. You know, when they ask you, are you willing and capable to assist people in getting off the airplane in an emergency? Do you honestly think that you are? That's funny because I work out about five times a week. I'm here okay. for a shoot. I'm a model and I have a very, very large social media following. Cool. I've been tweeting American Airlines this whole time letting them know your seat number, our flight number, what's happened, what you said. I showed them the photos, so they're going to take care of it for me. Okay. I don't think you'll ever see anything from it, and that, that's your own thing. Okay. So you know nothing about me by the that's size true. of my body. Yeah. You know nothing about me. So to say something, to have a quip like that back to me after I'm talking to you about this, after mm -hmm. you already apologized, is, a, did, is an extra <laughs> thing for you to do. <laughs> no, I don't think it is. You don't think it is because you think that. Are you a doctor? Let me ask you something. Can you assume something about me? Are you a medical professional? I would just love to know, like, where your expertise is coming from. That's none of your business. That's none of my business. So That's my body is also none of your business. So you have no Fair idea enough. what I can or can't do with it. Fair enough. Right. And I don't know if you noticed, but the entire time I've been sitting here like this to make sure that I didn't dare get in your seat. I know. You so. have an armrest over there. This gentleman and this gentleman, this gentleman over here has armrest. I have not had a single armrest the whole time because you both took up the armrests. But you also wanted to know if we could pick up the uh, armrests right, if because, they did move. Because before, they did move. Okay. 
So that was attempting to me. And if, and if you said no, then that would have been fine. It was a question. It wasn't, hey, move that. Hey, pick that up. It was, hey, can we pick these up? And they happened to not. And that was your choice. And if they did pick up and you said no, then that's your decision. I paid extra to sit in this seat because I knew I needed leg room. I have been researching first class flights and this class flights okay. for two weeks. This flight wasn't bought by me. It's bought by the company that's flying me out here to do this shoot. So I didn't have a choice on where I sat. I had a choice to get this bigger seat so that I didn't inconvenience anybody else. Okay. I know I am big, but I have not been in your way. And you have not left a neck mark on the side window. Yeah, that was really funny, huh? That's so funny. You liked that one, huh? Yeah. Don't ever treat somebody like that again. You're right. You don't know anything about me. You're absolutely right. You're absolutely right, Natalie. Thanks. Is this your final day? Yeah. Well, and then I'm coming back home after my shoot. I live in Dallas. Yeah. You're okay. Thank you. Next up, we bring you a British Karen racially insulting a female hotel concierge. You get it, get it, like that. Water. Look at it. It's raw. Absolutely. And it is going to lie about you. Because you don't go that age. Yeah, that is, that right. is raw and it's raw. Listen, raw. You don't live here. I'm calling the police out. Oh, yeah. Oh, Get out. What are going to do? Call the police out. Get out of here. I do not ever go in here yet. You and me, I'm a mouth for that. I'm a boss in ya. You came over on the boat. Meet this employee trying to save this woman from getting towed, but doing a good deed and helping her out backfires. Turns out, she's a Karen. Oh, this is worse than getting catfish, dude. There in the front. It's $300 to get your car out of impound if we catch you parking in our parking lot. Okay, so this is who I'm here to see. Is this, is, I parked here to come see this person. Okay, so yeah, so you want to come here then? That's who I'm here for. Okay, but you came from over there, ma'am. I grabbed a soda. Okay, we're telling everybody, don't go into that building. You can't buy a soda if you come here for your doctor. I'm here for my doctor at 1700 I understand Alhambra you... Boulevard, and you said I can't park here and I can't grab a soda? I'm informing you, ma'am, when we see you go into that building, and you can record all this you want, I'm just informing you, don't go into that building, please, because if we see you here, when you go into that building, it only takes But if one I minute. parked here, Hold on. and this is my, Hold on. where I'm at, this I'm is where to, I'm at. I'm trying to correct you, ma'am. You can't correct me, because this I parked here to Fine. come to this building. Fine. And but if I'm you've just... seen me walking over there, you should have been seeing me when I've been here the whole hour. No, you weren't here the whole it's hour, It's been almost 30 minutes. You should have been seeing me while I was here, so if you didn't see me come you out of here... What are you talking about? Don't try to walk away now. You're being I'm very racist. Walk. I'm going to walk You're away now. You're being very racist because you racist. just came up to me and told me that my Hold car on. can get told if I was Hold not on. here. You said if I was not here. Whatever. So can you make it clear? Whatever, because this is, Have a great this day. is my eye doctor. Who are you? Have a great day, Are you day, security? Are you enforcement? Who are you? Have a great day, You didn't even say who you are. Are you the medical division people here? Because I actually can have a, a complaint against you harassing me like this. Have a great day, Because I went to go get a soda. Have a great day. So who's this? Are you going to say that to my doctor? Because this is very embarrassing. Have a great day, ma'am. Enjoy yourself. Well, why would you come out here and harass me as the only black woman that's out here walking through the parking lot? There's the Chinese no people. Race, there's white people. Why are you just only coming up to me? I did not telling say me that I can't about come race, out of here. I can't come out of your seat. You're saying it is a racist issue. It is no, not. No, you're, you're the saying one that I cannot okay. park here unless I'm here. See, what you're so sad about and what you're so embarrassed Whatever. about now is because you didn't know that I was already here. She continues on following him, claiming he singled her out. You didn't know I was already here. Whatever. So that's embarrassing to you because you thought that I was just some black person coming from Mercy because you seen me. Here again. You didn't even you know, but how did you know I parked person. here? How did you I know I parked? Nothing. How did you Have know I parked day. here? You're making it an issue of, of African-American. You know okay, what? so you told me I cannot park here. 
That's what you just told me. If I was if not supposed to be here. Building. What do you mean if? Sir. What do you mean this is if? Not parking lot. This is a private business. Okay. Yeah, it's a well, private that's business. Right. That's what you could have but, said to me. Um, you could have said it like that to me. You could have said this is mercy and sorry. private. There but instead, you were very rude. You were very I rude. The freeway. Just yeah, you were very rude. And I got it all on camera. Girl, so I'm going to go see my doctor where I'm supposed to be at, okay? I'm going to go where I'm supposed to be at and make a big complaint about you. Yeah, because like he just said to me, it's three hundred dollars to tow your car. That's what he just told me. It's three hundred dollars to tow your car, okay. so you better go fast because okay. if you go get a sandwich, he might tow your car. Okay. Even if you're parked you. here for Thank your you. services, you're in trouble. What's your name? Because I'm going to report you. So whatever. Man. What is your name? Who are you coming out here harassing me? What is your name? Please. What is your name? Your name is please. What is your name? Please. So that's what I thought, white down. people so trying to ignore it. Trying to yeah, go the all the way around the building. Or you go out, here. Or you go out that way and I'm going to okay. report you because okay. you came harassing me. And, you know and I'm not allowed to get a soda. Make sure you choose who I'm, you're talking to. Yeah, I'm, I'm not allowed white. to get a soda. Not everybody in here is white. Thank you. Oh, you kind of white. So yeah, like I said, I'm going to report you because you're absolutely wrong. Yes, and take your hand out your pocket. Take your hand out your pocket in America. Yeah, take Whatever. your hand out your pocket in America. And she continues with her rant. It'll be a few minutes. Okay. Are you the security guy that was down there harassing? Your name is Ken, right? It'll be a few minutes, ma'am. There's people ahead of you. Okay. And who am I waiting for? We'll be waiting for Eileen. Okay. Are you um, for a gentleman with the hat is next for me? Okay. I, I don't want to shoot people. So. Oh, okay, this guy was just harassing me downtown. I don't actually have that much time. This guy was harassing me. His his name is Ken, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, he was harassing me outside of this window. I thought he was security, and I thought that he was um, some type of you know enforcement. And I want to make a huge complaint of how he was completely harassing me, chasing me down in the parking lot after I came here to get my Gucci's fixed. I, I just worked here, so... Because um, is there a manager for him? Because he just works I here, can, too. I and Yeah, he literally was harassing me, telling me that my car is going to get towed for $300, cracking his knuckles... And he's not even no type of parking enforcement. He's just somebody who's just inside of this building. And there's lots of doctors here. So okay, I want to get a big complaint. We're also doing the anti-reflective coating. Ma'am, you're not allowed to film in here. There's oh, patients here. I didn't, I didn't know that. You don't have to jump up that fast. I can stop the recording. Just okay. make sure you get your manager. You should have jumped up that fast when I asked for the manager. Whose side are you on? Leave a comment down below with your answers. If you're recording, ma'am, I'm gonna tell you right now, you need to stop. There's patients here that do not wanna be recorded. I'm waiting for a manager. The way you treated me outside, you need to be recorded. You need to go in the hall, ma'am, now. Are you gonna touch me? No, I'm not gonna touch I'm you. I'm waiting for the manager. And I'm telling you, you need to stop recording. But you're why were you harassing place. me outside? I'm asking for the manager and you're sitting here acting like that again. Here. Okay, you are recording I'll other step back and I'll office. wait. I'm not recording other patients. I'm yes, recording you, you. You're in an office. I'm recording, recording you. Patients, you need to step in the hall. Get your manager. She'll be out as soon as she can. Step in the hall or turn off the phone? Mm -hmm. Which one? You need to turn off the phone. Okay, don't say step in the hall. That's where I was going to go with if my phone. Turn Get out of my way. 
Oh, look at him. Trump supporters just yelling in my ear. I don't yell in my ear. Who are you to yell in my ear? Oh, my. How dare you? Ma'am, you need to stop recording people. No, you need to stop harassing people in the parking lot like me. I came to get my Gucci's fixed. These are my Gucci's and you were down there harassing me and I want to make you a complaint. Need to stop recording people here, ma'am. I'm recording you only. There's no one else here you besides a person who just yelled in my ear. Okay, well, I want your manager. Is there a manager here? Evidently it's not. So you're not security. We got the point that you're not nobody but a, a somebody else. And there's plenty of doctors here. So for you to come out there harassing me, I'm like I said, you're racist and I proved it. I'm going to you again, ma'am. You need to stop recording people in this office. I'm because... recording you with your hand back in your pocket. I'm recording you. Okay. We're going to notify the police, ma'am. And I'm going to notify the whole entire management how you harassed me as a black woman in that parking lot, knowing that there's all these people here and you're not even security or enforcement. And you're mad. Goodbye. And you have a wingworm in the back of your head. Moving forward, Karen goes crazy and destroys a screen. You don't need to have time, I got you. Okay? You're forfeiting that. That's on camera. I got it on camera. She, that's, that's right there on camera. 